We live on a world of wonders. A place of astonishing beauty and complexity. We have vast oceans and incredible weather. Giant mountains and breathtaking landscapes. If you think that this is all there is, that our planet exists in magnificent isolation, then you're wrong. As a physicist, I'm fascinated by how the laws of nature that shaped all this also shape the worlds beyond our home planet. I think we're living through the greatest age of discovery our civilization has known. We voyage to the farthest reaches of the solar system. We photograph strange new worlds, stood in unfamiliar landscapes, tasted alien air. And at the heart of it all is the powerhouse. A vast wonder that we greet each day. A star that controls each and every world in its thrall. Look at that! The sun. And when it goes, it really will be the end of us all. This is Varanasi. For Hindus, it's one of the holiest sites in all of India. Part of what makes it so special is the orientation of its sacred river as it flows past the city. This is the one place on the Ganges where you can bathe in the river on this shore and you can see the sunrise on the eastern shore. It's the only place where the Ganges turns around to the north, so you can do that. When the sun rises tomorrow, a truly extraordinary phenomenon will take place. A total eclipse of the sun. It's an auspicious occasion for a place that ancient Hindus knew as the solar city. <laughs> 